for the Employment Assistance Fund, you or your employer can contact Job Access via their number 1800 464 800. A worker who has a visual impairment starts their new job and realises that they can't read the screen or and the computer screen and the telephones. Then they contact their disability employment service, in this case it was Vision Australia, and speaks with their uh, caseworker there to find out what, uh, how to problem solve this. The Vision Australia caseworker then suggested applying to the Employment Assistance Fund through Job Access and uh, did so on behalf of the employee. The Vision, Vision Australia caseworker then contacted the employee's manager to discuss um, options and to make a time to meet. Then a independent assessor came and met with the employee, their manager and the Vision Australia caseworker to discuss uh, reasonable adjustments. In this case it was providing a magnifier, a um, an iPad and a uh, computer software to help magnify and to read things on the screen. This process of receiving assistive technology and being assessed is very person-centered and it is unique to that person and their disability, which is why it is very important that an assessment is made um, and once assistive technology has been received by the employee um, that's not where it ends you are also given training and if it is a physical or something that needs to be physically altered in the workplace that is done um, not by the employer and at no cost to the employer. From an employer's point of view, uh, there are certain incentives to employing someone with a disability, not only for inclusion, but there are also uh, wage subsidies in doing so. The wage subsidy scheme is a financial incentive of $1,500 for companies and employers to employ people with disabilities.